Hey guys, it's Ian. I just wanted to put this little bit before part three to let you know that the audio for this video is just completely messed up. I am really sorry about it. I tried to fix it. That only made it worse. So I just, I'm going to upload the original. And uh, I hope you guys still do enjoy it. If you guys are still enjoying the series, leave a like down below. I don't expect many likes from this video because of the bad audio quality. It just kept reverbing and I don't know why. And I couldn't get rid of it. Like the settings were fine from before. You know, they all worked great, and then it just started to reverb for no reason. So, I really hope you guys do like it. I mean, try and peer through the really, really bad uh, audio quality. But if you guys can do that, I think you guys are going to enjoy the episode. A lot gets done. So, I really hope, once again, that you guys enjoy it. And I will see you guys on the other side. Bye! Hey again, guys! This is Ian, and I'm back here with part three of Castlevania, a Harmony of Dissonance. As you guys remember, in last episode, we defeated the Skeleton Knight. And we got to the Skull Cave and switched castles. So, um, now we are going to move on to Luminous Cavern, which is one of my favorite parts of the game. Uh, it's like this underground bit of the, uh, castle. And the boss, I believe, is the Golem. I don't, don't hold me to that, though. So we're gonna find out on this adventure, yeah? Let's do it. Let's kill these boneheads. Alright, there we go. Skeleton rib. Skeleton rib. Ribby skeletons. <laughs> Back through here where we met Devil Maxim. Past the swaying knife blade of death. Playing pendulum guillotine thing. Past the apes. Are there skeleton apes? I have no idea. Down here. Down here. Whoa. <laughs> the skeleton spirit, I hate the range on those things. Ow. Damn it. The leaf on them. Alright, so let's keep going. Let's just keep swimming. Also, one of the things I want to do is I want to head back to that uh, tasteless room, as Jesse described it, and I want to uh, put that side table we found in the last episode in there. this guy, and then we can go uh, to the third castle. That's right, three castles. Well, technically it's one castle, but it's three separate ca there's two separate castles and um, three different areas. So, yeah, there's the Salem Witch. Turquoise. Then a hundred bucks. Wow. Who leaves a turquoise lying around in a demon castle? I don't know. Whatever floats your boat, I guess. Those are any companion cross as well. Because companion cross equals life. Ow. Oh. I just run for it. Run, 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 run. Save, I'd love to save. It, it saves your, your poison status? I thought it healed you. Whatever. So you sworn it gets rid of your poison status. Come here, punk. 
Alright, so one of the things I need to find is I need to find a uh, cross. That's, uh, that's not one. That isn't one either. No, I don't want holy book. Ow. Poison! Damn it! Yeah. Oh, it's a siren, not a sail emotion scan. Ooh, cutlery. Silver dishes. Oh, hi. That's right, I can double jump. I keep forgetting I can double jump. Head down here. Oh, MLG Pro. Major League Gaming Pro. Oh, yeah. Blocking a fireball with a flask of holy water. Yeah, you wish you had skills like those, don't you? <laughs> oh. We're in the wrong damn place. I... I feel like I'm gonna die here. Please tell me there's a life max up or something nearby. Oh, thank god. So I lost most of my life just to get more life. Alright. Fair? Oh, it's the merchant. Welcome. Why do you... Why do you have a shop in a place like this? Well, being the wandering merchant that I am, during my travels, I was suddenly swallowed up by a dense fog and ended up here. Still, there's no need to set up there's no need for you to set up a shop in a place like this. At first I spent some time looking for an exit. I couldn't find one, so without any other options, I opened a business right here. So what can I do for you? Let's see what you got. How much money? I think I five hundred bucks. I think while I'm here, I'm going to uh, sell this, uh, ticket price is only over 20, or 200 bucks, okay. Or 200 bucks. Oops. Buy. There we go. I don't know why one side's being cut off. I don't get it. So I'm noticing that the, uh, the, 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 the part of the siren frame there is cut off. I guess because of the ring. 
So without further ado, let's uh, go on to fight the boss. Pretty much back where we came from. Not the double jump. Down here. Not on the bomber on his face. So now I need the spell book because with the uh, the ice skill with holy water, it'll lock on to whatever I can hit and then do damage. Got him. He's dead. Easy fight. Let's get the whip pose too. Let's try and get an excellent. There we go. So back here. Oh hi. There you go, Steve boy. Oh, that just screamed. Oh man, it's never good when something's screaming in the background. Damn, I was trying to beat the block. No up. Venom. Or no Uncle Venom. Bad jokes are plenty. Got a mirror and a Yellowstone. Nothing to do now, but just head back, I guess.
Last thing I want to do, or next thing I want to do rather, is I want to go up here and I want to get the Sage Statue. And the Mana Prism. Next we're going to go in here and I think there's something waiting for me at the bottom of this. Yeah, there is. I see it behind the... This, the, this. Uncursed potion. Up here? It's not here. Alright, so let's just, uh, let's just go ahead and uh, go over to the third castle then. I guess there's nothing better to do here. Use the third warp gate. Justy, have you found Liddy? You're you're Maxim, aren't you? Hey, what do you mean by that? Uh, nothing. Forget it. So tell me, have you found Liddy? I haven't found nothing yet, but my memory is slowly coming back to me. Really? So Liddy is somewhere in this castle after all? Yes, I'm sure of that now. And I have also, and I know that I've also been here before. And the, and there's something I think you should know. Go ahead, you can tell me anything. The day you inherited the title of Vampire Hunter, I felt as if a wall had been erected between us, and for that reason I set out on my expedition. I wanted to be better than you and relieve you of your fate. Hmm. Long ago you told me of Dracula's remains. Do you remember that? Yes, I remember. The story of how my grandfather Simon gathered Dracula's remains and destroyed them to undo his curse. I thought my wishes would be granted if I too could gather them and destroy them. That means the remains found in this castle are genuine. They are identical to the ones I found, but I have little memory of what happened after I found them. Well, I only remember Lady being brought here. If true, Dracula's remains may be giving rise to this castle. Forgive me, this is all my fault. I'm not the one you, sh you should be seeking forgiveness from. You, sh you ought to apologize to Lady first. We better hurry and find her. Yes, yes, you're right. Okay, I'll be off then. Maxim, I believe in you. Thanks, Jesse. There's nothing that way, by the way. It's just a, just a warp gate. Bye. Skills. Another high potion, that's always good to have, just around. And then life max up. Really? here listen i hope you i really hope you guys enjoyed the episode if you do leave a like down below so we can't get maybe 10 or 20 likes for our third video in the series and um comment if there's anything that i missed or you want me to go back and do if i can do it i will do it in the next recording session and uh check out my channel and subscribe for more daily video, video game videos and yeah as always i'll see you guys next time bye